<laughs> As part of our ongoing series first look, I had the opportunity today to visit with Nikki Snyder, who owns Shelf Indulgence in Sarasota. It's a little coffee shop and bookstore right at the edge of the uh, Ringling School of Art and Design. And uh, it, has a, uh, it has an interesting vibe to it. So where we're sitting is in Shelf Indulgence, which is, describe what, what this is. Um, it is your local community bookshop. We're also a coffee shop as well. Um, just a place for people to come and connect and pick up some great books and conversation. How fun. We like it. And, and, <laughs> and, and book lovers all over are, is this, this is a place that they want to come. Well, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you going to bring to the Florida Antiquarian Book Fair this year? Well, we specialize in collectible science fiction and fantasy. Um, so the majority of what we're bringing falls into those categories. Um, lots of signed books, lots of special editions. Um, one of the main focuses for us this year, too, is just kind of on um, contemporary signed books, um, fantasy, again, and science fiction, but specifically, like, the special edition. A lot of these um, companies that are, like, Fairy Loot, Owl Crate, Bookish Box are publishing these really fantastic signed special editions of popular novels, but including art on the inside, on the end pages, or special dust jackets, uh, sprayed edges. And these are kind of books that new book collectors are interested in. And that's what we're excited to also offer. Not just maybe some of the classics, but um, you know, just stuff that people get really excited about. You know, your favorite book, and then you see it signed. So there's a large portion of that. Um, we do also have some classic favorites. One of the things I'm excited that we're bringing is the first edition, first printing of Anne McCaffrey's Dragonflight, which is the first book in the Dragon Riders of Pern series. I just love the old sci-fi art covers. There's nothing like it. They certainly don't, <laughs> they certainly don't make them like that anymore. I've also got one of my favorite books of all time, Kurt Vonnegut's Sirens of Titan. Um, it's the first paperback printing, the Dell. It just, again, lovely cover art. Kurt Vonnegut's kind of science fiction novel, uh, published in 1951. One of my personal favorites. Something else I wanted to talk about that we're bringing, this is one of my absolute favorites. Um, the Road Goes Ever On, which is... Um, Tolkien's poetry and music from Hobbit, um, which has lovely illustration of an Elvish. And it's just really special. It's just, if you're a Tolkien person, it's just a really wonderful addition to have to your collection. Unfortunately, it doesn't have its original dust jacket, but it is from 1967 and the boards have held up very nice. And of course, you read, you're fluent in Elvish. Yes, absolutely. Um, the last thing, and I thought this was just kind of current events to talk about um, Roald Dahl, first printing of My Uncle Oswald, which of course is one of his novels for adults, not children. But I know he's been in the media frequently talking about the rewrites of his children's books and whatnot. And this is certainly not a children's book. This is a very bizarre story if you're not familiar with it um it's it's quite risque actually um but just again kind of exciting just to have the first edition so those are my favorite things that we're bringing to the fair among many others and so what else um again just lots of signed science fiction and fantasy some george martin from the game of thrones series um a lot of the, a lot of anthologies, um, Alan Steele, and then there's some Philip Jose Farmer as well, the subterranean press um, that they had done with the, the slipcase limited edition artwork inside. Just, just pretty books, <laughs> beautiful books. And we're just so happy that we can bring them and show them to others. So, uh, 
Why Sarasota? Why this location? We love this location, um, mostly because of the people in the community. You know, we're frequented by a lot of the, the new College of Florida students, the Ringling students. There's just a whole atmosphere of uh, creativity. And it's just a great, just a great little artsy community to be part of. What are you looking for forward to uh, at the Florida Attic Grand up there? Um, I'm hoping to do some shopping myself. There's a, there's a few books on my list that um, I'm hoping that we'll find. Um, I know last year I had my eye on a set of um, a Game of Thrones complete series signed, and I'm kind of hoping they're still there. Um, but just looking forward to connect with some of the booksellers that we met last year and just kind of became friends with. You know, through the year you follow them on social media and you see what they're up to, and you really just kind of feel like you're part of this bigger community of booksellers. So it's kind of like catching up with old friends. So what advice would you give to someone who has just discovered the Florida Antiquarian <laughs> Book Fair and uh, they're going to come for the first time? Um, bring cash <laughs> and allow yourself enough time because I remember my first experience feeling almost overwhelmed by the amazing things, you know, seeing a, a signed copy of To Kill a Mockingbird or assigned Hemingway or, you know, just something rare that you've, that's just so special. I particularly am into signed books because I feel like it puts you and the author kind of together, you know, at, that at one point they were holding that book and you're holding that book too. And I just think that's kind of like a special relationship between you and the books. Thank you so much for uh, taking the time to do this and to uh, be part of the Florida Antiquarian Book Fair. Thanks, Alan. Thanks for having us. We, we can't wait. We can't wait. Hello, this is Alan Smith. Thank you for watching our video. You can watch more videos from the Florida Antiquarian Book Fair by clicking on the boxes at the left. Click on the right to subscribe to the Florida Antiquarian Book Fair channel. See you at the book fair.